Have you ever wondered why Yorkshire Terriers are so small yet so feisty? These pocket-sized champions known for their silky coats and spirited personalities are a paradox of size and character. Yorkshire Terriers, or Yorkies as they're affectionately called, are a breed that embodies boldness and affection in a compact package. Their distinctive traits and charming disposition have made them a beloved choice for dog enthusiasts worldwide. Stay tuned, as we delve into the history of this fascinating breed. The story of the Yorkshire Terrier starts back in the 19th century. As we travel back in time, imagine the rolling hills and bustling industrial towns of Yorkshire, England. It was there, amid the soot and steam of the Industrial Revolution, that the Yorkshire Terrier breed took shape. In the mid to late 1800s, workers from Scotland migrated to England, bringing with them several varieties of small terriers. These included the now extinct Clydesdale Terrier and the Paisley Terrier, a breed known for its long, silky coat. The hardworking folks of Yorkshire, known for their tenacity and grit, found these rugged little dogs perfectly suited for the tough conditions of their coal mines and cotton mills. The Yorkshire Terrier was not initially a lap dog for the leisurely rich, but rather a working class hero adept at hunting and killing rats and other vermin that plagued these industrial sites. Their small size allowed them to squeeze into narrow spaces, and their fierce determination made them excellent ratters, keeping workplaces relatively pest-free. An important chapter in the Yorkshire Terrier's history involves a breed known as the Waterside Terrier. These were small dogs weighing around 6 to 20 pounds with longish, blue-gray coats, it's believed that the Waterside Terrier significantly contributed to the development of the Yorkshire Terrier we know today, particularly influencing its distinctive coloration and silky hair. Over time, selective breeding led to the miniaturization of the breed, and the Yorkshire Terrier's beautiful coat became longer and silkier. However, they never lost their tenacious Terrier spirit. Through this evolution, the Yorkshire Terrier began to catch the eye of the middle and upper classes, they admired not only the breed's practical skills, but also its striking appearance and spirited personality. The journey from the coal mines and cotton mills of Yorkshire to the laps of the upper class was not a quick one. It was a transformation that took place over decades, shaped by the changing social and economic landscapes of the time. So, the Yorkshire Terrier started as a working-class hero, but how did it become a beloved pet? From the coal mines and cotton mills, the Yorkshire Terrier made a surprising transition. As the Industrial Revolution roared on, the Yorkshire Terrier, initially bred as a working dog, found itself in unexpected company. The breed's petite size, glossy coat and lively spirit began to catch the eye of Victorian middle-class families who saw in these dogs not just a rat catcher, but a fashionable companion. The Yorkshire Terrier's transformation from a working-class hero to a middle-class darling was not abrupt. It was a gradual shift, guided by changing social norms and the influence of a few key figures. Among these, none stands out more than Huddersfield Ben. Huddersfield Ben, born in the 1860s, was a Yorkshire Terrier of remarkable beauty and temperament. His silky blue and tan coat, straight and well-proportioned body, and vivacious character were admired by many. He was an exceptional show dog, winning numerous awards and was highly sought after for breeding. But Huddersfield Ben's influence extended beyond his physical attributes. His owner, Marianne Foster, was a passionate advocate for the breed. She worked tirelessly to promote the Yorkshire Terrier not just as a show dog, but as an ideal companion for families. Mary Ann Foster, with Huddersfield Ben by her side, played a pivotal role in shifting the public's perception of this breed, and the public was receptive. The Victorian era, with its emphasis on elegance and refinement, was the perfect backdrop for the rise of the Yorkshire Terrier. The breed's petite size made it a perfect lapdog, its lively spirit added an element of fun to the household, and its beautiful coat was a symbol of luxury and class. What began as a trend among the middle-class families soon caught the attention of the upper echelons of society. Royals and aristocrats alike were charmed by the Yorkshire Terrier's elegance and spirit. The breed had successfully transitioned from the grime of the coal mines to the opulence of royal courts and aristocratic homes. And just like that, the Yorkshire Terrier became a symbol of elegance and class. The Yorkshire Terrier didn't just win hearts in Britain, it went on to conquer the world. This small but mighty breed began to gain popularity beyond British borders in the late 19th century as families moved and took their beloved pets with them. One of the first stops on the Yorkies' global tour was the United States. 
The breed was introduced to America around the 1870s, and Americans quickly fell in love with the Yorkshire Terrier's compact size, energetic personality, and exquisite silky coat. Their popularity grew swiftly, and by the 1880s, the Yorkshire Terrier had made such an impression that it was officially recognized by the American Kennel Club, a significant achievement for any breed. But the Yorkie's journey didn't stop there. In fact, it was just beginning. This lovable breed made its way to other parts of the world, from Europe to Asia and beyond. Each new place it landed, the Yorkshire Terrier left an indelible paw print on the hearts of those who encountered it. In addition to their popularity as family pets, Yorkshire Terriers also made a name for themselves in the show ring. With their striking looks, confident strut, and sparkling personalities, these dogs quickly became favorites among show dog enthusiasts. The Yorkie's success in these shows further boosted the breed's profile, making it even more desirable to dog lovers across the globe. The Yorkshire Terrier's journey from a humble working dog in 19th century England to a beloved companion and showstopper on the global stage is nothing short of remarkable. It's a testament to the breed's unique appeal and the universal human love for dogs. The Yorkshire Terrier had become a global sensation. Whether they're strutting their stuff in a show ring, snuggling with their families, or simply going for a walk in the park, these dogs continue to win hearts and spread joy wherever they go. The Yorkshire Terrier isn't just a dog breed, it's a worldwide phenomenon. So where does that leave the Yorkshire Terrier today? Fast forward to today, and the Yorkshire Terrier, affectionately known as the Yorkie, has become one of the most popular breeds around the globe. Their small size, coupled with their big personality, has endeared them to millions, making them a favorite choice for many families and individuals alike. Today's Yorkie is still very much a companion dog. They are known for their loyalty, their love for their humans, and their ability to adapt well to different living situations. Whether it's in a bustling city apartment or a sprawling country home, these little dogs make a big impact. They are often described as having the heart of a lion, packed into a small, portable size that fits easily into many lifestyles. In addition to their role as beloved pets, Yorkshire Terriers continue to make a splash in the world of dog shows. Their silky coats, confident demeanor and lively spirit make them a delight to watch and a challenge to compete against. They showcase their breed's rich history and the dedication of their breeders and handlers in maintaining the breed's standards. But it's not all about looks. Yorkshire Terriers are also recognized for their intelligence and agility. They excel in various dog sports and activities such as obedience, agility, and even search and rescue. Their keen senses and quick learning abilities make them a versatile breed that can take on various roles, further highlighting their adaptability. As we navigate the 21st century, the Yorkshire Terrier continues to be a testament to the breed's enduring appeal. Their popularity shows no signs of waning, with their adorable looks and vibrant personalities winning hearts in every corner of the world. So, whether they're strutting their stuff on the show ring, showcasing their skills in a competition, or simply snuggling up on a couch, the Yorkshire Terrier remains a breed that captures the heart. They are a symbol of companionship, resilience, and the joy that our canine friends bring into our lives. Whether in a dog show or a family home, the Yorkshire Terrier continues to be a beloved breed. Let's take a moment to look back at the incredible journey of the Yorkshire Terrier. This breed's story is one of resilience and transformation a testament to its enduring charm and appeal. Originating in the industrial mills of England, the Yorkshire Terrier started life as a ratter, a tough, tenacious dog bred to keep factories and mines free from vermin. It was a far cry from the pampered pet we know today, but even then, its courage and spirit were undeniable. As the industrial age gave way to the Victorian era, the Yorkshire Terrier transitioned from a working-class hero to a companion of the elite. Its small size and striking appearance made it a perfect fit for the fashionable ladies of the day who doted on these little dogs and paraded them as symbols of their status. But the Yorkshire Terrier's appeal wasn't confined to England. The breed soon spread across the globe winning hearts everywhere it went. Today, it's one of the most popular breeds in the world, cherished for its lively personality, its loyalty, and its distinctive silky coat. The Yorkshire Terrier has come a long way from the mills of Yorkshire. It has navigated the changing tides of history with grace and agility, adapting to new roles and environments while never losing its unique charm. The Yorkshire Terrier, a small dog with a big history. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the past of this remarkable breed.